Yo, this shit is sick. This is the Telltale Batman. Sorry, guys, I had to make an account which needed passwords to start the game off. So, for that, I am very sorry. Episodes. Alright, man, so. I guess, uh. This is what we do, man. I don't know, I don't need the crowd play. The bat symbol is barely visible. There we go. Select a bat tech color. Let's do red, right? You know what I'm saying? Keep it in gangsta. Black and red. Alrighty. So, I really can't talk over the storyline too much. So, uh, yeah. take. The game series adapts the choices you make. The storyline is tailored to how you play. Yo, so there you go. Winged Industries. Wing Tech. Going into City Hall. Graphics are so weird looking, man. Hey, what are you? <sighs> oh, fuck. I was not expecting that. Get it open. On it. Why does it look like it's so like hey, skipping? It's gonna show. We'll bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. Oh, Christ. The commission. Oh, I think an elevator hey, works like wait, that. You know what I'm saying? Down. Like, uh, a downward thrust doesn't always. Take the stairs. I heard stories, you know. <sighs> Some three home a little bit less. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. With all the other flying animals. Oh, I gotta hit that shit. What? My oh, man, is he walking slow or is the game just animating everything slow? Huh? Keep doing this. I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed. You. Yep. The city is safer now. It's made you a target. And people will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shot out of the sky. I can handle it. Whatever got in, don't let it get out. Yo. The 
music is real sick. I get it now, I get it now. I'm like uh, almost dead or something. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on! Come on! Come on! <laughs> So badass. Behind you, big boy. Intimidating, you're succeeding. Yo. Criminals are becoming afraid of you. So are the police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. No, he's just getting dressed. That's what he's up to. Without a scratch. So far. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all of this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. Gotham needs a hero. 
Someone to hunt down people like you. So that makes me, what, a villain? Sounds fun. Gotta admit it, though. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. Then let's put you in a cage. Bring it, Bat. Oh, she bodied me. Fuck that one up. Shit, they just did that move on CWC. I think it was TJP who did it. Why go to all that trouble for this? Yo, come on, Shit. Batman. A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. God damn it! I said don't shoot! No! Wait! Missed. I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. Don't struggle or you'll fall. Oh, but that's what you crave. The struggle. I know men like you. Stole that shit. 
step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Time to save the city. I don't know how I feel about that, you know what I mean? Kinda weird. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. I'm not sure if I liked it or what. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Now, for too long, this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. Yeah, the graphics are weird, you, vote for Harvey Everybody Dent looks like a bro. ...is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. It's weird, too, Say like, hi, the audio. Bruce. Sounds so echoey. Hi, Bruce. Well, I tee him up and he knocks him down. <laughs> now, Mr. <laughs> Wayne and I do business. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together, we will change Gotham. <laughs> Mr. Wayne! Thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Just wanted to make an entrance. Congratulations, you almost missed it. You are a pillar of this city and my campaign. I need you here, tuxedoed and shaking hands. No one came here tonight to see me. They want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little FaceTime with potential donors. Uh. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. I'll do anything for Gotham. It's my home. It's our home. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around yep. as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. All right, all right, all right. How about, uh, put a dent in crime? Hmm? Look at you. It's not half bad. I'm gonna use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harley, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Come on. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. <laughs> well, I'm flattered, truly, but this night is about getting Harvey Dent elected so he can fix those potholes. Hmm. I think I speak for half the room when I say politicians are puppets. Oh, come on now, Bob. I'm not a politician. I'm a crusader. Hmm? No strings attached. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. 
Oh, this Fuck city's him. luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. You... And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. I'd say it all depends on the man. Sometimes you need a person who will go off script. Such as dressing up in a bat costume? Yeah, I'm just picking random ass answers at this city. point. Though the cape may be a bit much. <laughs> and don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. With Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible. Truly terrible. Yeah, and tragedy like that at such a young age must have been crippling. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... Uh, well, I don't like to think about maybes. And I'm sure you don't either. Well, thank you. I wish my parents could be here speaking with you, too. And thank you, Bruce, for investing in the health of this city's future. You have our support, Mr. Dent. I Go like get him. The We're fact that way. I feel like, you know, like Bruce is like a little bit vulnerable so far. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but expressions that went better and stuff than expected. Along. So weird. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. No, no, it's all right. You can stay. Thanks. Bruce? This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now, so formal. Call me Bruce. Well, Bruce, you've been going around Yo, pleasing everyone tonight. He is a G. But how are you doing? You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Everyone loves the host. You're king for a day. Mm. Just a day? <laughs> I would have guessed Bruce Wayne has that feeling year round. Yeah, well, I take nights and weekends off. Mr. Wayne, you've You've got something on your collar. Um, is that blood? Yeah, it looks like... Spilled some wine. It, it'll come out. Stick to clear alcohols, Bruce. I never stain. Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Oh, damn. Carmine Falcone? Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham. Yeah. For all of us. But at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. I don't want him in my home. Actually, you don't want him angry. Trust me. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. Yo, I'm about to pop this fool. You know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk up, sky high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. 
though the decor offends my eyes. Oh, man, all flash, no class. Let's talk privately, shall we? Hey, <laughs> I like this guy. Ready to do business before we even introduce ourselves. Yo. But we'll get to that. Come on, Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. You're a respectable man, I hear. Yo, I'm going in on this cat. I'm not shaking your hand, motherfucker. Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. Can't have no crime in my well, you house. You should know, Mr. Falcone. My analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill. At... Hey, what's private audience? Oh, come on, guys. Bruce, you'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. We talk alone, just you and me. Sorry, Harvey. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll get a drink or something. Christ. Yeah. Yeah, well, that's just like Harvey, huh? Wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. Unlike most people I've met, Harvey actually has integrity. Yeah, He's man, trying if I can't make say Gotham one or the other, place. then he might know so who am I am. So will you. Hey, we all carry this city on our broken backs. Might lighten the load if we do so together. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat, or I can pull it out from under him. Whatever happened to being a gracious host? Okay, imagine, this is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, yeah. politicians. I make them all move, and I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Oh, I'm everyone's friend. Which means you're really no one's. Pick a lane. Before you have a head-on collision. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew Yo. a chance to shake. Fuck that noise. And which the break. Don't you dare talk about my father. You're getting worked up over nothing. Uh, hell, I knew him longer than you did. People don't say no to me. Not for long. Master Bruce. Yo, everybody looks yes, crazy in this leaving. game. I recommend seeing them out. He wouldn't want to be rude. Heed your butler's advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick, and he's gonna get what's coming to him. Yo, is this more like the start of the whole game? Oh, okay. Alright, so now that the intro's done, that was pretty hype. The first part was a little, eh, but I like the, uh, the Bruce area of the beginning. So yeah guys, I'm going to uh, stop the video here.
Oh my goodness, man. And uh, we'll start up another one. Alright?